11 days away until the big day. And as you've seen during this election cycle, the candidates make lots of promises. Tonight, Kins 5's Jeremy Baker verifies a promise made by Harris. While they're courting Americans for votes, both former President Trump and Vice President Harris have made many claims about what they do in office. That leads us to tonight's claim submitted by viewer Mike Mendiola. Is it true that if elected, Kamala Harris will give all first time home buyers a $25,000 down payment grant? Our sources for this verify are Patrick Jones, a community organizer who works with marginalized communities, and Daniel Cabrera with Sell My House Fast in San Antonio. The Harris Walls campaign says in order to get the grant, you must have paid rent on time for at least two years, never owned a home, or owned a mobile home without a foundation. But it would take time for the legislation to pass, and it isn't guaranteed. The first generational buyer would be somebody whose parents never owned a home, or parents whose parents were perpetually renters. We're talking about like the first person within a, a family tree or the you know the family lineage to have ever been granted the opportunity to buy a house. Jones says first-time generational buyers would be eligible for the grant as well as additional credits. Ultimately, she'll have to get it through Congress regardless. So I know it's something that is an initiative of hers. And I think it's a good one. I don't want there to be a false hope of we're in reality and it still needs to get passed through Congress before it could go into effect. So in this case, it is false. As president, Kamala Harris would not have the power to give all first-time homebuyers a $25,000 grant for a down payment. Jones also told us if your spouse owned a home, but you were not involved in the purchase, you could be eligible for the grant too if Harris wins the election and if it were to pass Congress. For the Verify team, Jeremy Baker, Ken's 5.